Welcome back. We are here on Ether looking at the cryptocurrency market. And this is going to be my daily forecast for the cryptocurrency market for Monday, November 9th, 2020. If you'd like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. And we do have a service on Patreon, uh, which is a signal service. And you'll also get access to our full commodities uh, analysis, which will help you um enter a trade and to leave trades and so on and several people have already signed up and it's working quite well so if you look at bitcoin so we have rallied quite significantly we are still overbought so uh, keep that in mind and the technical indicators for bitcoin are turning around at this point so it is a question how far we will go there are a few entry points here um, for example, here is one of them around this area here, around 12,000. Uh, that would be a fantastic entry point. That is exactly where the 50 moving average is at the moment. That is where this was previous resistance. Another area would be around here, which is around 13,000. Uh, um, and the next entry point would be around here, which is around uh, 13,800. So, technical indicators at this point, stochastic has turned around. Same goes for the CCI. The, the RSI is technically flat at this point and is overbought. The only indicator that hasn't really turned around is the MACD. So, at this point, we are probably going to test these support areas here. And the idea is to buy it as cheap as possible. Because we are still in an uptrend, so we are we have been quite par parabolic uh, in this move at the, in in last week, and every single time that happens, we have a massive pullback, and those pullbacks are buying opportunities because you can buy Bitcoin as as cheap, and you know that it will rally when it is in an uptrend. So it's just a matter of basically entering at a certain point. So these three points are. Uh, viable entry points and this is of course the most riskiest and this is the least riskiest because this should be uh, this area here should be more supportive than that area there so these are technically uh, depending on what risk you want to enter on you can basically enter here and it falls further and therefore you're basically caught there so the further down this basically falls then the less riskier it becomes and also the more profitable it becomes because yeah, of course there's a lot more room to the upside so if we rally here then of course these highs of 15,950 will be uh, major resistant a break above that will open the door to much higher levels which i don't think are is going to happen at this point so if we look at atrium hope i pronounced this right so we rallied significantly uh, last week and at this point we are having a pullback and uh, this pullback will most likely be short-lived because this area here should be a major uh, a fair not major but fairly uh, supportive around 414 a break below that opens the door to the 50 moving average and a break below the 50 moving average opens the door to 330 um, if we rally from here, break these highs, then we are going to these very highs of 482. Technical indicators for each room are mixed at this point, but they are more bearish than they are bullish. Uh, so this was a massive move, so you should anticipate a pullback. But as well, we are in uptrend. We have been for a quite a long time. Uh, but all, every single time we have these parabolic moves, we have one here, then you have a a similar fall to the downside therefore much easier to trade when trades are when markets move in 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 small steps and in, in uh, instead of these massive moves to the upside or downside so um cci is negative uh the same goes for the stochastic um rsi is flat and uh macd is trading above the signal but it's fairly flat so expect a pullback but 
that is absolutely a buying opportunity. So hope you find this helpful. You're welcome to uh, support our channel by subscribing. Hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. And the link to our Patreon channel is below. You're welcome to join. Uh, there are around 40 uh, traders on the channel at this point, And it is a very good community. So good luck and thank you very much. Thank you.